Hi, my name is Geraldine Gray. I'm a Salesforce MVP, and I'm here today as part of the App Mavericks videos. This is a series brought to you by the App Exchange to talk to partners who have some really cool and innovative products on the platform. Today, we're going to talk to Brad from Steelbrick. So Brad, uh, please go ahead and introduce yourself and tell us a little bit about Steelbrick and what you guys do. Yeah, so thank you, Geraldine. So my name is Brad Williams, Director of Sales Engineering for Steelbrick. And the company actually started in 2006 when Max Rudman, our founder and CTO, uh, was an early adopter of the platform. And he developed the CPQ application, which stands for Configure Price Quote. Over the next few years, uh, between five employees, they were able to amass almost 100 customers uh, until late 2013. Godard Abel, uh, the ex-founder of Big Machines, bought the company and scaled it quickly. In the last year, we've grown to over 85 employees, over 200 customers with a 97% retention rate, and over $30 million in investment. I know that you have a lot of expertise and a, a lot of people that have long histories in CPQ. Um, tell me a little bit more about what makes Steelbrick different from all the other CPQs that are out there. So a few things, we really try to leverage the Salesforce One platform where we can. So standard objects, standard functions, and then supplement that with pre-built functionality, uh, which fills some of the gaps around complex configurations, around uh, complex pricing models like volume or, or tiered based discounting, and also in automating uh, the renewal process and co-terming of add-ons. Uh, the other differentiator I would say is, is the expertise that we have. Uh, we have a lot of people who have come from either Salesforce or other CPQ vendors, and that really allows us to offer best practices in our implementations and to our customers. I think that's something that when customers are looking for a solution, they really appreciate is being able to work with a team of experts who actually have solved the problem many times over, where it's, you know, it's not their first rodeo. So, um, can you tell me some concrete examples of customers where they've had success? What do they say about you? Sure. So uh, Nimble Storage is a great example. They're a flash storage solution provider. Uh, before Steelbrick, they were using Excel. And as you can imagine, that's not really integrated to other systems or connected. It was a very manual process and also error prone. And uh, what they found once they selected and implemented Steelbrick was that they, they cut 20% of the, the errors in their quoting and ordering process. And they were also able to reduce the time that it took to enter an order from 20 minutes down to just two. And one other quick example is Marketo, uh, automation uh, marketing software. Uh, they simply said after they went live uh, that you've changed the way we do business for the better. You know, I love it when I hear about other partners benefiting from partners. So can we actually take a look at the product and see what it's going to look like on the platform? Absolutely. So we'll show you what it looks like on the uh, Salesforce One mobile platform. Okay, so um, I am in Salesforce One mobile. I've got a quote created already. Um, I can see things like the account, the opportunity, some other details of this particular quote. And I want to kind of invoke the CPQ process. So I'm going to click on edit lines. That's going to take us into the quote. And I can see the different products that we've selected. I can always go back and edit these. I can, uh, I can add additional products if I want to as well. So when I add products, that'll take us to the product and price book selection. Uh, I can always go in and select a package. I can uh, configure that, and that's going to be driven by rules and logic, so that if I make any mistakes in the process, uh, it's going gonna, it's gonna to restrict me from moving forward and give me an error message. So let's add this product. When I click Save, uh, that'll bring that bundle back over uh, to the commerce area, which is where kind of some of your pricing adjustments occur where any discounts uh, and then any approvals uh, might also happen. And the next step in the process then, if we save this, would be to generate documentation from this. Uh, and in this case, we'll do it uh, as a proposal, which is uh, going to be uh, available to us in Chatter. Uh, so I can see this here um, uh, as I'm following it in Chatter. So let's generate this. Uh, you're going to see first the cover page, then the cover letter. We've got our products and services, and we've got terms and conditions. And that's how you can go through the CPQ process on Salesforce One Mobile. So Brad, I can see lots of use cases. We've implemented it. We've used it. We know how great it is. Um, if I'm a system admin, or I'm a customer, or I'm interested in learning more, where shall I go and what shall I do next? 
The best place to find us is either on the App Exchange, obviously, uh, so we encourage you to go there, or to our website, www.steelbrick.com. Excellent. Thank you so much. This has been really fun. Really appreciate you taking the time, and I'm sure that you're going to have tons of interest. It's an absolutely brilliant product. Thank you.